Hey everyone, today I'm making a review and roaming videos on my Sapien V1s because uh, Arbor Designer and Chris, or Chris wants to see a videos of them and yeah, so but this will be a, this one's going to be a review and I'll do a roaming video after this because I'm not doing both in one video though, so <laughs> um, yeah, right now you can see there's a lot of Robo Sapiens. Um, well, Robo Sapien obviously, of course, everyone knows a lot about Robo Sapiens now because they've been out for like eleven years already. <laughs> um, but this is obviously what he looks like. Um, they came out in two thousand four, um, and they've been selling for years and in multiple colors. Right now, they don't sell a lot of the colored ones. Really, you see a lot of white ones and. I, they're not as popular now, the white ones. Like, if you've put a white one on eBay, don't think it's really going to get sold that fast because people can still go to the store and buy the white ones. But if you have a colored ones, you may just end up getting it, uh, it sold for a good price. So, yeah. All of the colored ones were sold from, like, 2004 to 2009 and stuff. Um, because they, they quit making them after two, 2009 Christmas, and then they came back in 2013, and they're still selling now. If you guys don't know, there's actually a new Robo Sapien coming out called Robo Sapien Blue. It's a black Robo Sapien. It's the same thing. It's just black, and it has blue cables. It has RS on the side, unless that's just a prototype marking, but it shouldn't be. It should say that. Blue, I wonder what that means. Yeah, it's going to be Bluetooth, obviously. There's also a Roboraptor Blue coming out as well. And, I mean, it's great that they continue making these and everything. But here's just, here's the thing, though. I mean, all of these, the RoboSapien X, this is an X, this is 2009. Do you see a difference? No. There is absolutely no difference between them. That's 2004. There's small differences with 2004s, but 2008-9 versions like this with two, uh, 2013Xs, no difference. The black one, um, there's also a black Robo Sapien that was just previously made for 2014 Christmas. It was exclusive at Kohl's Online. Um, and uh, it's a shiny kind of black. I guess it's kind of shiny like this. Um, but the UK also has a different black one that was sold back in 20, 2004. It's kind of like this. It's not that shiny. It's kind of just a solid, plain black. Um, you can, uh, there was also a Chrome Robo Sapien X, but those ones are hard to find now. The, even the originals are easier to find than the X one, because I, I, they were just limited. The Chrome ones, the first ones made, they actually made a lot of them. But anyways, back to the Robo Sapien Blue. Um, I mean, yeah, again, like I said, it's nice that they continue making them. But how long are they going to make these until the demand has just had enough of them, you know? Because, yeah, there are a lot of them are different colors. Well, they're not making that many colors. There's like four maybe that they make. But, you know, the problem is they all do the same thing. Every time they come out with a new one, same thing. It's the same dance. It's the same hi -ya actions, you know. Nothing's different. They're not reprogramming them or anything. They're the same same thing, just RoboSapien Blue. It's going to be Bluetooth now. RoboSapien X and R RoboSapien. People had actually thought that they, I mean, there were, thought, people thought they were going to be a little bit different and have new features, but they just didn't. And some people had thought that they put in just an extra sensor for the dongle that comes with it to control it with your phone or iPod. Um... No, it, the dongle doesn't just control X. It will control all of these except for him because he's a knockoff and he doesn't work on RoboSapien's remote either. So yeah, this will control all of these, even RoboWisdom. So yeah, there's not an extra sensor in him. He's identical, exactly the same as the older ones. Um... You know, and they advertised him having blue eyes. He didn't have blue eyes. The Huawei website said he would have a path tracing f feature, which he doesn't. You know, yeah. His 
supposed to be more advanced sensors, but it's all the same sensors and all that stuff that never, they're all the same. <laughs> and I don't think Huawei plans on making them any different. The only ones that were kind of different were Homer Sapien and Spider Sapien, but they were still kind of the same because, you know, Spider Sapien, he had new sayings, but he didn't have that many changes. His dance was, surprisingly, Spider Sapien is the only one that actually has a different dance compared to the rest. But he had more sayings, but they didn't feel all of his sayings. He still had the some of the older Robo Sapien sayings. I don't know why, they just didn't find enough sound files to put into him and homer sapien was sold in the uk and he had even less scenes than spider sapien so basically he's just a robo sapien because he says less of homer scenes than spider man says of spider man scenes so he only has like a good six seven scenes he has maybe a couple more just maybe like about two more but yeah you'd think that they'd put in a little bit more sounds to make them a little more interesting but they just didn't and you know how they're just not going to bring back the RoboSapien V2s back to life, you know. They're not bringing them back ever because they say it'll cost too much. Or are they just afraid that the wires are going to break down again or something? I mean, yeah, V2 is a lot bigger. These are kind of basic because obviously other companies are copying off RoboSapien. So it's probably not that hard. But look at how much money they're putting in to making the same thing over and over again. And they're not putting that money towards making newer updated versions of v2 it doesn't even have to be v2 it's just newer versions but i suppose you want me to show them in action now all right but that was that just the little beginning of me talking about things also I'll, they come in all these colors the red the green i used to have a chrome this silver is burned because you know i got off ebay for 50 bucks well that's another thing you want to be careful when you buy these older ones off ebay because a lot of them almost all of these have problems now the old ones the new ones don't really because they're still new and but these ones do have a lot of problems like you it'll be hard for you finding some that actually if you're a picky person and need the robots to work they won't um the problems i guess the worst problem you get is um six of these i got off ebay and pretty much all of them except for one had problems that they weren't even supposed to have um, this one had a bunch of wires that came off. There's probably still some coming off. This one is actually the one that's never really had a problem. Besides, he's leaning forward a little bit, so I'm afraid he's going to snap off soon. And he has a couple of scratches, but that's normal for the green ones. Red one, he was snapped off his legs. Silver, he's burnt and snapped. Um, their legs are standing now, but he was broken. I bought him broken, though, because he's a fake and I needed him. Um, clear. I, he wasn't really broken. His motors were just weak, and they still are. You know, so none of these worked perfectly. You know, so when you buy old ones, you really need to pay attention in the photos. Check if the legs, if they're in a position like this, yeah, they're they're snapped. So don't buy that. And I've seen them sell broken ones for fifty bucks, and they say it works hundred percent. Yeah, don't. So yeah, and also they come in a uh, blue color as well. There's actually a rare uh, UK version of the Spider Sapien that came out in 2012, so it's a lot different looking. And the last color is a, a gold one. It's a chrome gold, so yeah. There's also more knockoffs, but I don't think I have enough time to talk about them all. And I've made reviews on the Robo Info. Like, there's a pink version of him, a white version of Robo Wisdom, and black fakes that look exactly like this but they're fakes and then there's black ones with silver shoulders that's a fake but let's get them started now this is also the one at the room that got at the rummage sale with broken legs okay this one has to sit out its batteries are low these things also have an extremely long battery life um i got this in 2013 for christmas and i still have never changed the batteries once yet it's been that long here, I'll get them all on here. A lot of them have really weak arm motors. Oh, he... This is not going to be easy. Alright. And I'm sure you, a lot of you know the controls, but if you don't, you don't... I mean, if you're... If you like... A lot of people don't even know how to control these. Like, 
when I brought, brought them outside, the neighbor kids didn't even know how to use them. They see dance right here, and they push this. Well, that's programmed. That's not going to make them dance. I mean, just look. It's it's select right here. Green, red. Dance is red. So you push red, and then dance. Spider Sapien has a wire coming off of his power connector. Also, if you really want to know what's the difference between the 2009 and the 2004 version, um, it's more of with their voice. Um, the, um, I'll show you, like, listen to how the first ones sound. It sounds kind of clear, you can understand it pretty well, and it's just, it sounds nice. But the 2009s were supposed to be updates, but listen to the sound. It's actually not as good as that one, it's actually more crappy sounding. And their their dances were, they tried to update the dances. You can tell because they swing their arms a little bit more than the older versions. That's how you can tell if it's a newer version. They also roam for ten minutes, and the old ones roam for five minutes. Oh yeah, they have that old roaming feature where you program their buttons here, back up, turn, and do some actions. You know, and when they when you push forward, when they hit something on that side of their hand they'll back up or replay the program and they won't stop until they go to sleep or whatever but anyways here's the dances com um, comparing the dances of the original and the new 2009 obviously it's not 2009 anymore but still this is how you can tell the difference and usually most of the old ones are just white ones white ones and chrome ones have this new dancing thing because they are remade in 2013 not too much of a difference, but you can tell he walks more, though. And a wire's coming off his arm. <laughs> they, their walking was up improved a little bit. Because when these ones got old, they started walking in circles. And the X's and the newer white ones don't walk in circles just as bad. But they don't work as well with rechargeables either. When you put rechargeables in these ones, they kind of walk in circles a lot. Some don't, but some do. These two, two do. He used to not, but he does now. So, And they've also got those features pick up, you know. Of course, they can't even pick up anything, so I don't know what that feature is even there for. Well, those are... Yeah, his wires are off. But yeah, they also have those um, touch sensors, you know, to respond if you have something programmed on them for the roaming or just, yeah. Th those things get old pretty bad. Like, they, they can they can uh, wear out pretty easily. Like, the arm ones, because they move. See, this one doesn't even really work that well. This one is stuck. This one doesn't work. So, yeah, that can be a problem with the old ones. I guess that was kind of the review. I mean, you get the point. They they walk. Oops, keep using the wrong remote. They, I mean, they walk. They all do the same thing. They're not. I don't think they're making them any different. But if they did, that would really be cool as well. You know. You know, they're just a basic remote control robot, but they're still the most popular because they're basic, you know. It's kind of like that ultimate robot toy because, you know, it does all the basic stuff like, you know, pick up, even though it can't really pick up. Control it to walk around. It's a remote control robot, kind of like a remote control car, just a robot. They keep making remote, remote control cars. They keep making Robo Sapien, you know. So, yeah.